is Friday. I don't often vlog on the weekend. Well, it's my weekend because Kevin's home from work. <laughs> but I thought I might try this weekend. I'm still feeling so good. I can't believe how much I've got done this week and how good I've been feeling. Of course, you've got a good balance with doing stuff and pacing myself. Fibro, that's very important that you don't overdo things. I wake up every morning in pain, but I've actually, well, I've only been for an hour and a half, but I'm feeling pretty good today. <laughs> So, <laughs> take advantage, definitely. So I've got a few things we are gonna to do today. Behind me, you can see a new, finally, finally ordered a cover for the sofa bed that's in the study downstairs. It's, I mean, that sofa bed's, I don't know how old, probably like 15, oh no, it's over 15 years old. We've lived here for 16 years and we had it before that. So, could be pushing 20 years old. It's old <laughs> and it's very, faded from the sun when you see old photos of it and it's threadbare the, the fabric's really deteriorated we're not sure whether we're going to take it with us to the new home but we've been, I've been meaning to buy a cushion cover for like years finally got around to it of course I think I've ordered the wrong thing when it comes it's got a big for square arms and that one's got big rounded curved arms didn't think of that and I'm sure it didn't say that in the description when I ordered it about the square arms. I mean, there's a picture of a couch with square arms, but you know, fibro brain here. Didn't really think about that. I got Kevin to check the measurements for me because I didn't trust myself on that one, but he obviously didn't think of the arms at the time either. So I think we're going to give it a go. It wasn't that expensive. So I think we'll give it a go. Even if it just does for the next two years while we're here. And then if we do take it with us and we decide we're keeping that, because it's a very good quality, a good quality sofa bed it's a comfortable sofa bed we've had adults sleep on it they've always said how comfortable it is because obviously it hasn't been slept on that much so the mattress is still in good nick well as far as firmness anyway so if we do take it with us which i think we probably will i'll pray to get it professionally recovered so it look comes up nice because it would be worth it i think to do that but anyway we'll give this a go when i clean in behind that because it really is done in behind there and maybe other stuff in, in the downstairs study because apparently Kevin said he's got the scanners come. He said it's really big, so I guess mm, I don't know what really big means. <laughs> um, hopefully, it won't be too ridiculous in there, but we'll have to put that in there too. And I need to do some tidying up. So I think that'll be our focus today is in, in that room, at least this morning. Get a bit of stuff done. Hopefully, get the puppies out. It's very overcast and gloomy looking out there today. I think there's some rain this afternoon, but this morning it's just cloudy. So, I have actually opened up the, all, the, all the blinds, which don't always get open if the sun's <laughs> coming in there. I tend to keep them closed, but everything's open today because, as you can see, it's you know, it's grey out there. But anyway, I'm just going to have my second cup of tea for now. I'm going to have a few bliss balls and. Yeah, anyway, I thought I would vlog. <laughs> stay in my pajamas today but I thought if I do I would not get anything done so I've been had my shower got myself ready moves in her pajamas <laughs> I'm probably staying in her pajamas hello Kevin will be getting dressed because we're going to take the dogs on a walk after uh, just, like just making some breakfast I'm having my fried rice and Kevin said he felt like scrambled eggs so I'm trying to make some scrambled eggs but it's been so long since I have made them I think I've made them a bit too runny so. Oh no, it's getting a bit thicker. 
been so long since I've made them, I think I've forgotten what to do. Well, I didn't have a small pan, so oh, well, this works. So she's a big pan. Dog's food's ready. He's got some toast. And we're going through the table like proper grown ups. <laughs> do you think there's someone here who likes eggs? <laughs> That's a bit rude. <laughs> But I'm so cute. You're not getting any. I'm not rewarding you for doing this. Yeah, but I'm so cute. Cutterbees is under the table. Hello. <laughs> Chewy's back. <laughs> this is a bit naughty. You let him stay there though. <laughs> it's cute. It's hard to say no to him when he's so cute. I think it's either zero zero or zero five. Something something like that. You're a funny boy. It, it could just be five as well. Um, I, don't, I don't know. It, um, it's changed over the different versions of doorbells we've had. I can't remember which one this, this one was. You're so cute. Right, cool. But you'll hear it. Someone will. I hired this space up the other day. Well, we don't know how to do Grab an end, chicky babe. Yeah. We'll put it up that shit or something sometime. Just had this stuff off the couch. <laughs> no, 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 Deal with. Thank you for sorry for Christy and I. Hi. Ah, good riddance. She wants some help, Mom. That's not too bad, is it? Well, this one's kind of a mess. That side looks good. That looks a lot lot better what do you reckon like we've got a new sofa now i've just got to clean in behind there it's not too bad really but so this is a good kind of dog's job stuff there so i'll get that cleaned up and push the couch back in
that's a lot better. Also, I've got a new couch. <laughs> it doesn't fit perfectly, obviously, I've got the wrong arm, but I think that's okay. Still better than what was there. <laughs> what do you think, Mary? Well, you're probably the dogs and you were the main one that used it. <laughs>as an elephant it's not quite that big so I don't think it's too bad I was worried it was going to be tall and ugly and that's fine it looks fine there I did set up along here and get a reduction line going hopefully while Kim was doing that I was just doing a bit more of my puzzle and um, yeah getting the beach part of the next part I'll work on mm -hmm. then I'll try the color down the bottom and I finally got my Christmas present from Christy I finally got it printed up <laughs> so I'm gonna go um, this week. She didn't snap fish so I got sent out. So I'm going to go pop that in a frame. There we go. It's going on the front table there. We're <laughs> finally heading off on our walk. Bailey's gone next door. <laughs> yeah, Bailey's gone next door. Marking his head off. Well, it was a nice walk. I'm very tired now though. <laughs> Just sitting down to have... Lunch, I think it's pretty much what I had yesterday. I've added some of that tofu I cooked this morning. That was so nice. I've been nibbling on that. <laughs> and I've got some hemp seeds on top. Oh, I've got tomato today too. <laughs> so, I'm going to have that. I think we're going to watch some YouTube. And later on, I might watch some documentaries or something later on. What's going on, Chewy? Make sure you're talking to Daddy. Open the grandpa. This beard. This beard is so long now. Go on after his legs. <laughs> so funny with his little talking. <laughs> You're a funny licker. Fuck you. My glasses are all smooth. <laughs> <laughs>
I don't like him look at my glass. <laughs> I don't know if I've got any of that on camera or not. You didn't use too much of a kisser. Did I drop some food on me, did I? Thank you. Thank you. Sure, you're a funny. Really, really delicious. <laughs> What's really nice about this as well, guys. So you just pour everything yourself. So oh, you got a spot, Daddy. You got a spot. Massive pot of water over there. It's been a big smoochy, this one. So I think that's really good. How you can help yourself. Yeah, there's no sort of like formula. You have to sit here. It's just tip, pick a tip. You like, have a seat. With the puppy kittens. Oh, with the puppy kittens. Enough sun there. Yeah. When your fingers are really long. He's a wee beastie. Oh, fluff of feet. Why are you chewing me? Why are you chewing me? <laughs> what are you doing? What are you biting me for? You don't need to chew on me. Chew on Grandpa. Chew on Grandpa, not me. What do you want to eat my finger for? Everyone's going to hear the background food. Watching a watching a, a vlog on a on a river cruise. We're saying we should have been already been on that river cruise. Hulu. Not yet though. One day, hopefully. <laughs> this boy's been crazy though. It's been crazy demandings. And Pat's and Carlos Cardo. Well, he was having Pat's before he went away. Now we've got Mr. Chewy. What a funny boy. Yeah, you, you're the funny. funny boy. Oh, you want to do bites, do you? Yeah, he was chewing on me before. <laughs> <laughs> you're a funny boy. We're trying to watch YouTube with the dogs at the one dinner. So Coda's now just... Um, being a not a boycott, what's he being? I'm just sitting in Kevin's view box. <laughs> Kevin says, Well, you won't feed me dinner. I've tried kissing everyone. It's not gonna get you. No, I'll just sit time. here so you can't watch TV anyway. He does not look impressed with the situation. God, it's just been a palace door, Papa, aren't you? He's so cute. He's a twisty little nose. I can see his little tail going behind him. <laughs> good boy. You're not in a good position there, though. Chris is taking clean line next door, and Coda was very upset. So he pulled out his snuffle mat for him. We tried to let Fuzzy have a go, but Fuzzy started ripping it apart straight away. So Fuzzy's just um, having free snuffles. He's happy. It's easier for him. <laughs> so I've just spent the afternoon watching YouTube. We're now watching Startup that we're watching. Great happy show that it is, but it's very intriguing. So Kevin's got leftover stir fry from last night, but he picked out all the tofu. <laughs> Didn't like the tofu in it. Um, I usually do the fake beef stuff, so I'll do that again next time. And I've got a rice Mexican rice bowl. There is rice under there somewhere. And a big blob of refried beans and just, yeah. Stuff out the fridge. And some chickweed from, that was from our garden that they made from, we did for me, washed and everything. So that's going to be yummy. And the last of the salsa that Dan made. <laughs>